Hi guys, welcome back to Dan's Fab Lab. Look what showed up today. Watch these nails, Dad. Still gonna have to fabricate the B pillars to go on the front. That's all right. That'll be kind of fun. See, we have a seam here. Typically, in the original tubs, there was no seam there. That's okay. A few little whoops and stuff in here. Some of these, uh, these we'll get rid of. But some of these, you can see. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. There's old spot welds along in here. Dimples from that. And uh, on an original restoration, from what I understand, they want to keep those because that looks factory. So anyway, underneath, we got all new metal here. She's uh, set up for the uh, ambulance doors right here that uh, would go on the back if the hard top was replaced. So anyway, the half tub has arrived. Excited that the half tub arrived today. Um, as with any aftermarket part, there's going to be little issues uh, that may have to be addressed. And I can see one in the floorboard right there where this corner of it dips a bit. Don't know whether that's anything we can live with or uh, it'll have to be addressed, but uh, all in all, looking this thing over, it's a pretty nice uh, tub. It is the half tub, so it comes up right behind the right behind the seats and the B pillar. I will have to fabricate the B pillar, uh, which goes right here, and it, it accommodates the hard top, the uh, front portion of the hard top, and right at the back of the door. But anyway, that would be. This guy right here. So, and it needs uh, it needs to pretty well be replaced, at least the top of it and stuff. This all looks pretty sturdy right through here. So there might not be all that much down towards the bottom, take care of some things, and then of course the rocker panels. But anyway, over here, um, all in all, I think the next step is I'm gonna lay out some paper, make some patterns, uh, so that if I need another one of these, I can just pound it out myself. And uh, they even did a nice job, got me a new fuel door. 
Um, but anyway, pretty happy with it overall. It's going to save me a ton of work. So anyway, which means we get the Jeep on the road a lot quicker. I, I Jeep, the Toyota Land Cruiser, get her on the road a little quicker. Well, that's a little update on what's going on. Now it's time to start making some uh, other patterns for like the rocker panels, inner panels, front fenders, things of that nature. Uh, start some dismantling. And again, going to make patterns off the tub that just came. So, as always, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. See you next time.